hello and welcome my dear friends uh, today i'm gonna show you how to create this cool uh, ruby of surfic uh, tutorial and this tutorial i'm going to show you how to create this uh, 3d sphere without any third party plugin in the adobe after effect so let's start in this tutorial uh, i have used this uh, map with uh, remove I remove this uh, background from it in the Adobe uh, Photoshop and I just export it to uh, After Effect. So first of all, we will create uh, a new uh, this uh, new composition uh, by 720p, 25 frame per second. 30 second long our composition is ready so we will drop uh, this uh, world map here so first of all you will uh, put a drop shadow on it so we will get a little bit depth here so after that uh, we are going to drop uh, CC sphere plugin. So now our uh, sphere is ready. We will just reduce this to 260. And you will go to the uh, light uh, with the, you just decrease the light. And we will increase light height to this. After that, we are going to go to shading, ambient. Uh, we will play with these settings, diffuse, and also specular. So in the reflection we will put reflection to something 12 and we go to cool reflection uh, for the reflection map uh, for uh, reflection map uh, we will we need another layer for that I will use this uh, this layer here we will just uh, invisible here in the setting we will choose that layer so now here you see this reflection from that layer so after that uh, you will duplicate all this map layer Control D the first one uh, we will choose outside the render and the for second one uh, we will choose inside so now we have two pieces uh, one is uh, inside and this one is outside so we can put anything in the middle of them uh, now we are going to create another uh, another uh, composition by dragging this uh, world map composition in it so you got the same size uh, composition so we don't need this map we will delete and we will just create some um, solid any color you like in this case I'm using this light blue color I'm using this light blue color I will control D duplicate on the top layer I will drop grid so grid so we will play with settings and also here in the border I will put two pixel the thickness of this grid 
it is cool the bottom layer we will press T for opacity and we bring the opacity down to 50 now we will go to the first composition and we will drag uh, this uh, second map hold that, that we just created we are going to put it in the middle of this both layer the inside and outside and now we will also apply the CC sphere CC sphere uh, effect into our control Z into our this uh, great layer so now the great layer is also uh, ready for this layer the top layer we put the radius to 260 for this we will put 258 so now this is inside our uh, first and second layer which is looking very cool so now the basic uh, the sphere is ready now it's time to animate our sphere uh, to animate the sphere we have two ways or we will pair uh, these two layer into this and we will animate one layer or we will animate three of them separately in this case uh, I will uh, animate one by one so now this is the first this is the Y rotation uh, so we will uh, press this uh, stopwatch it will um, automatically create here one uh, keyframe we will go to end of our composition uh, we will uh, animate this 360 degrees by one complete circle so I uh, wrote here one same process we will go to second layer rotation Y rotation uh, you will press the stopwatch go to end of our composition and we will put one also for the third uh, rotation uh, Y rotation we will go come to uh, timeline uh, press the stopwatch go to end of our timeline and we will mention here one so our sphere is animated now we will take a quick render my computer is very slow so it will take too much time I will not uh, uh, render this so now everything is animating in the nice way so now you will create a quick background for it a simple background uh, this uh, I created a new solid so in this solid you will drag effect generate or ramp you will change the ramp shape to uh, radial the first color we will take white the second color we will take something brown and now we will move this uh, handle to the center and this one we will move it away so now this is beautiful background also if you want to put some text in this our sphere inside so here we can put our text we will go to this uh, here I will just tap Sahak graphics Sahak graphics and now we will just place this somewhere mm. we 
you will press this somewhere here now we will check so our text is here you will bring it down little bit and you will make it small Now we see our text is here in the sphere. We will put drop shadow on it to get some depth. So now my dear friends, our sphere is ready. Uh, you can play with this, we can uh, practice, it, practice it, so this is very nice uh, sphere, hope you enjoy this tutorial, for more tutorials, uh, please subscribe our channel, uh, so this will be a complete uh, broadcast tutorials, and we will in the next tutorial we will put some lines moving lines around this uh, sphere or some waves so be with us subscribe our channel see you in the next tutorial